poor currency worth 1.2 crores. This has happened uh, just in, uh, the, in the past few hours. This is after a tip-off was received. My colleague Nikunj Gar joining us on the broadcast. Nikunj, what is this? Where has this happened? Well, uh, uh, Rishabh, this has happened between uh, Patna and Lucknow. The flight uh, was starting from Lucknow and the tip-off was passed uh, by the uh, Central Industrial Security Force once they noticed suspect movement of the cash to uh, the port in uh, 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 Patna. And uh, this individual was carrying, uh, ultimately found to be carrying at least 1.2 crore rupees in uh, the old uh, 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 demonetized currency of the government of India. And he is a Thai national. He has absolutely no business of carrying uh, Indian currency in such such large measure. And uh, clearly, uh, this, this points to a demonetized currency of the government of India. And he is a Thai national. He has absolutely no business of carrying uh, Indian currency in such such large measure. And uh, clearly, uh, this, this points to a new modus operandi of the money cleansers or people who are changing the money, the old currency at a commission, that they're using the foreign nationals as couriers. These foreign nationals are being employed because foreign nationals would usually uh, invite much, the least amount of suspicion in such businesses and would generally get preferential, prefer, uh, preferential and... Also got a much higher $5,000, I understand, uh, amount, to, amount to exchange, uh, Nikunj. Well, yes. I mean, the fact of the matter is that uh, uh, because of their status, because of their being uh, foreign nationals, because of the fact that nobody would usually suspect them uh, carrying the old currency notes or indulging in s s smuggling of the currency, uh, the these foreign nationals are being used. Now, this individual has been detained. The income tax officials at Lucknow are, as, at this point of time, counting the currency. Uh, they have collected the currency. And this individual, remember, Rishabh, any Indian national, of course, if he's carrying currency in such large num uh, measure, uh, has also got to declare that currency to the airport authorities. But uh, a foreign national has absolutely no business. Okay. Because absolutely no business. With okay, so clearly another, another dodgy laundering racket is happening to convert the old notes into the new notes. Nikunj Garg for getting us that new twist coming in from Patna. Thank you very much for joining us and leaving it there for more breaking developments coming in.